I always give away too much. Mm. It's like I've got no sense of time. Hey y'all, it's your girl Stay Hall, and today is officially day one of the Wagovi journey. So for all of my Life for Tribe members who are committed to going on this journey with me and sharing my experience, welcome back to the channel. I so appreciate all of the love and support. And if you're new to this channel and maybe you just tuned in because you saw Wagovi and weight loss in the description, welcome and please consider hitting the subscribe button so that you can become a permanent part of this Life for Tribe and go on this healthy lifestyle Wagovi, body transformation, getting off the blood pressure pills, all the things journey along with me because I am going to track my experience week to week. And so today is officially day one. I have not taken the Wagovi injection yet, but I'm preparing for it, meaning I forgot to take the B12 yesterday because I wanted to get that in my system one day in advance. So since I forgot to do that, I'm going to take all of my supplements first, wait a couple of hours, kind of let them get into my system, and then I'm going to do the injection. And yes, I am going to show y'all how I decide to do the injection and the place that I choose. So first things first, the B12 under the tongue tablet quick dissolve i did call my doctor's office and ask them to prescribe me the b12 injection i called friday and my nurse practitioner wasn't actually in so they said that they'd have her look at it today i haven't heard back but it's still early so but y'all know me if i don't hear back i'll be calling again but yeah it's just a teeny little tab i don't even know if it'll focus on it there we go and you just stick it under your tongue, like so, and let it dissolve. So while that's dissolving, I am going to prep my water with my electrolyte package. And so that's what I'm gonna do. I already have my handy dandy cup. No, it is not a Stanley, it is a soul full. And this thing keeps ice over 24 hours. So haven't tried hot in it because I don't like to put my coffee and tea in the same cups that I use for water because that coffee and tea taste does not come out. So, but I'm sure it does, but the ice stays forever. So let me get the packet together. It's just like, you know, any of those other drink enhancers. It's just a little powdery thing. And it is the electrolyte mix. And this flavor is cherry pomegranate. So if y'all saw my last video where I was, where I just got the Wagovi, I did the little haul and showed y'all everything that I had purchased to get prepared. So this is going to be that. So my husband, <laughs> I just dropped them all over the floor. My husband's calling, but this is perfect timing because I'm going to get the water mixed up and then I'll call y'all back. <laughs> all right. So here is the pen like I showed y'all. And from what I have researched, it's like the little window is clear. And then that's how you know that this pen has not been used. And then once you actually inject it, the window fills in, I believe, with a yellow color. And so here is the cap. You just pull that off and the needle is inside there, which I know y'all probably can't see it because I am right here live and in person with it and can't see it but the needle is in there and that's how you do the injection. You'll have to push here to do the injection. And I think today I'm going to inject in this big old belly <laughs> because I feel like that's where most of the fat is. That's my target area. That's where I want to lose. So let's just get right after it. So I'm going to go ahead and inject it. I'll pick y'all back up in a second. All right, y'all. So I'm going to get my alcohol. Put a little on my cotton swab and clean the area. Let me move back a little bit so y'all can see. I'm cleaning a big area because I know I'm not going to be real able to remember exactly where. So clean the area and then you just remove the gray cap. And like I said, the window is clear. 
and then I'm just gonna press this into my stomach and you hear one click, that means that the medicine is going in and then you wait for this yep, to fill up to yellow and you keep it in there for 10 seconds or more because you wanna wait until the yellow stops moving. So I'm gonna go right here. Heard the first click. Let me get on my tippy toes. Second click. And can y'all see? Cause I can't see. How am I supposed to see the yellow moving? Okay, I can see it now. It's moving, 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 moving. And it has stopped moving, but I am going to keep it in for another 10 seconds because I want to get every drippity drop. But do y'all see the yellow bar? Hopefully y'all see it. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Pull it out. And hopefully I got it in there. And there we have it. No blood. No nothing. So let's see. And that's my first injection of Wagovi. So let's see how this week goes. Hey y'all. So happy Tuesday, officially the second day of Wagovi, the day after my initial injection, which I took yesterday, Monday at about three o'clock. And yeah, I'm looking a little sad because I weighed myself this morning and I'm actually up a pound. So who does that? <laughs> Only me, because I have probably watched every single Wagovi, Ozempic, Monjaro, Semaglutide, whatever, Zetbound video on YouTube, and I haven't heard one person <laughs> say that they were up a pound the day after their first injection. Try not to be discouraged, but... It was almost kind of like, I got to laugh to keep from crying type of thing this morning because I was not expecting that. Now, did I expect to be down five, six pounds? No. Did I expect maybe to not have lost any weight? Absolutely. But to be up a pound. And so yesterday what I did was I took all my supplements. I had a snack of just like some lunch meat and cheese in the afternoon. And then my one meal, which was a half of a ribeye steak some Caesar salad, and then I kind of did the loaded steak because you know I'm doing ketogenic. So we did the sour cream cheese scallions on the steak. My watch is buzzing like crazy. And um, that was it, that's all I had yesterday. Plenty of water, like I said, did my supplements. And then last night I had a cup of ginger and peppermint tea with just a little honey before I went to sleep. So I don't know what's going on but we're gonna keep trucking keep doing the right thing i'm getting ready to make a cup of tea now i found this little detox cleanse kit at marshall's the other day i don't know if y'all can see but it has a couple of different teas in it and so it has moringa which is cleanse balance relieves temporary water gain Turmeric Slim Chai supports weight health. Dandy Liver Detox supports healthy liver function. And Organic Ginger Roots supports healthy digestion. So I think I'm going to mix and do a bag of the ginger root and a bag of the moringa. Let's see what happens. But yeah, that's where we are today. And so I'm going to make some salmon and spinach souffle for dinner. I'm doing the one meal a day. I haven't even had coffee today. Probably won't do coffee because I'm going to do the detox tea. Am I hungry? No. Could I eat? Yeah, but I'm not feeling hungry and all I've had is water today. So, you know, it's just day one, but it was just a little like really up a pound. <laughs> and I did, I laughed immediately when it popped up on the scale, but it wasn't funny, but it was just like, what am I going to do? 
<laughs> what am I going to do? So yeah, that's that for today. So today is officially one week with Ozempic and I am down six pounds, like about six pounds, three ounces, something like that. So as far as the weight loss, everything has been fine. My symptoms still the only thing I think is the dry mouth. However, as y'all can see, I am in the bed, sounding congested, and this is where I've been for the past two days. I have come down with something. I don't know if it's allergies, because I really don't claim having allergies. I don't know if it's a cold. However, I did watch someone else's Wagovi Journey videos, and the same exact thing happened to them like three to five days into their first week of Wagovi. They ended up with severe cold symptoms, so that's where I'm at. So I don't know if it's the Wagovi or not, but it's nothing, you know, that I've never had before, but I don't get a lot of seasonal colds, but I've just been taking some NyQuil, and I'm taking the NyQuil high blood pressure because you have to be careful when you have hypertension of the medications that you take and thank goodness a lot of the over-the-counter meds have come up with ones that are high blood pressure safe and so I've just been continuing to take my vitamins my supplements I just finished a premier protein shake not much of an appetite because of course I have the Wagovi in my system and then I have all of this going on which normally takes your appetite away Anyway, so yeah, so that's where I am fighting through it. Not the worst thing in the world. Just curious to know if it is just a natural cold or if it is a side effect from the Wagovi. But I guess it's either here nor there. I'm treating it like I normally would. I'm staying hydrated, doing all the things. But I am six pounds down. So the Wagovi is truly working. I've had zero nausea, zero digestive issues, zero headache. None of that stuff. I am very fatigued, but I didn't get fatigued until I started getting the symptoms of the cold. So tomorrow, I will take my second injection, still of the 0.25 dosage, and uh, we'll see what happens. But overall, it's been a good week. And just, you know, trying to figure out what this whole cold thing is about. But I don't want to blame it on the Wagovi if it isn't. And had I not watched that other lady's video where the same thing happened to her, I definitely wouldn't have thought it was the Wagovi because you get cold. So, you know, and this weather has been crazy. I live in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, as y'all know. And the weather has just been crazy for these past couple of months. Just hot and cold, hot and cold. So that has a lot to do with it anyway but I just wanted to make sure I picked up the camera because I want to be very intentional about going week by week with the Wagovi and so this is the end of this first week and we will take another injection tomorrow and I'll pick y'all up then so thank you so much for joining this journey with me I hope that it is giving some insight information inspiring whatever whoever's watching it for whatever reason i hope that you are getting something out of it and i'm going to continue this journey week by week until i reach my goal and then decide whatever the after wagovi is going to be so y'all know the drill i appreciate and love each and every one of you for tuning in for those who are new to the channel welcome 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 and please consider hitting that subscribe button and becoming a permanent part of the life or trap and always love one another and always be kind but don't forget to live your life l-y-f-e Love yourself first explicitly. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. I always give away too much. Mm. It's like I've got no sense of touch.